What inspires you and how can you turn that into creativity? Hi, this is Eric Copeland, president of Creative Soul Records in Nashville, Tennessee, and you're listening to the Brand New Me podcast. Welcome to episode number 129 of the Brand New Me podcast, where we find creative ways to help you thrive in life and not just survive. Stories from my own life and entries from my journal and current stuff that's happening in my life right now. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for listening every week. I appreciate it and I love hearing from you. So keep it coming. This week's fan question about Portraits of White, the upcoming Christmas show, which by the way, do you have your tickets yet? Go to portraitsofwhite.com and look on the Buy 2021 tickets. And make sure you bring a group of 10 or more and you can get a 20% discount on your seats. Tickets are already selling. I'm so excited. We got off with a bang the very first day the box office opened. So keep it coming. Well, this week's question was, what inspires you to create? Not just music, but in general, what inspires your life? That was a really simple question to answer and it's going to sound cliche but it's the truth I can find creativity and inspiration in almost anything that happens in my life and I was relieved to be reminded of that from one of my favorite songwriters Robert Sterling he has a great book called The Craft of Christian Songwriting he's written several hits and he's just a great songwriter I've uh, even had him do a songwriting workshop with some local songwriters a few years ago and he says that songwriters must look at the mundane things in life anything that happens it might sound dull But you have to look at the mundane things, any little thing that happens. And you can find inspiration from two basic categories, reading and listening. And I found that to be true. And in fact, over the weekend, I took some time and I sat down. I thought, you know, if I would just write out the titles of my songs that I've recorded on my albums, I wonder if I could point to a very specific seed or kernel of idea. And you know what? I can. So I just thought it might be fun this week to share with you just a few phrases for some of the songs that I've written and where those song ideas came from. So I'm going to share what happened and then the song that came about after that. Big Sister Flies Away Big Blue Sky Vocal Exercise From My Heart Digging in my garden, Master Gardener. Wilted flower garden, rain. Y2K, just when you think. Sunday sermon, living fire. I feel like I'm always fighting another battle. God is able. Racine, the memory of you. Husband shoveling snow moments a discouraged friend who you are in Jesus the word turn turn and look in his eyes youth missions love me a moment of overwhelming peace sometimes bad news be joyful family finances the bottom of grace Doubts, I still believe. Faulty synthesizer, never by accident. Family farm auction, bitter on the heart. Making a career decision, wrong thing. Flashy female speaker, personalities. Watching a friend's life change, free from the inside out. A spontaneous spirit jingle. He can. Pussy willow tree on childhood farm. Innocence is good. Visiting my father's grave. 
someone else's shoes. The harp and the bowl sermon in the hand of the Lord. Cat looking out the window, shatter the glass. Blooming lilacs, missing you. Tragic accident, I can pray. Phone call from my brother, pond beside the barn. Teenage slumber party, wonderfully created. 100 year church celebration, I know God. Radio show, miracles. Radios in India, one small box. Playful piano, joy to the world. Snowdrifts, portraits of white. List from preschool mom, mops. One night I had a dream, back to the heart of Christmas. Writing challenge from my producer, ride in the sleigh. Church drama, you with me. A Christmas shop, take another look. Facebook comment, hope walked in. Figure skating, brand new me. I'm feeling free, feels good to be free. David and Goliath, who do you think you are? Drum beats, out of the box. Misunderstanding, don't quit. Motorcycles, it's all about the ride. Serenade song for church staff, blessing song. There you have it. Most of the songs that I've recorded, I can point to a very specific moment, phrase, or something that I experienced. Everything you read, experience, see, feel. Maybe it's something you can journal about. Maybe it's something you want to write about, write a story about. Maybe you want to paint a picture, sew a garment, knit something. There are so many ways that experiences in life can inspire us and lead us to further creativity paying attention to these things along the way that we experience and see and read and feel in life. That's where we can begin to be creative. And that's where inspiration comes from for me. Whatever I see, taste, feel, hear can eventually turn into a song. I think it'd be fun to just send you out with a song. I'm just going to choose one. How about the radios in India? This is a song from my Portraits of White album called One Small Box. But there was a story about villages in India who were getting radios. And they were able to tune in to a specific broadcast and receive hope and encouragement. And that one story sparked the inspiration for this song, One Small Box. Hey, go get your tickets for Portraits of White. I want to see you and your friends and your family at the show. Candlelight and a single rose Set the tone for his love proposed Lifetime of promises made to the one he loves All wrapped up in a velvet box Something Something small is nothing short of a miracle. Look and see the loving thoughts wrapped inside that one small box. Daddy's watching his little girl, ribbons hang in her gold. She gets to his house, she loves her music box. Something big from something small is nothing short of a miracle. Look and see the loving thoughts wrapped inside that one.